Uh, the international trip to Spain was a, was a great opportunity uh, for the players to, to get some playing time in, to get some practice in, uh, to experience another, another culture, another country, and uh, really to come together uh, while they were away. Uh, we had 24 players on the trip, and so it was very beneficial uh, for those players. Uh, they really got a lot out of it, and it was uh, every time I've did one of these trips in the past, this was my fifth international trip, the first with a men's team. Uh, we've always had success because of that extra extra little bit of pre-season that we get. So we're excited for uh, what they learned in Spain. There was some really good soccer. So there was some uh, good opportunity for the players to play against some top level teams. And uh, we're hoping to use that experience uh, in confidence when we come up against the strongest teams on our schedule. Yeah, well, now that we've uh, been picked to finish fourth in the conference, a, a big jump from the seventh we get picked last year. Uh, we obviously finished fourth last year, our first time in the MAC playoffs. So the goal last year was to have uh, less than less than one goal and, and two uh, two goals for. We were actually a little bit a uh, little bit over one goal on average. We we're a little bit under two, uh, and I think that uh, transpired to those nine one goal losses uh, with some of them in overtime. So if we can turn around half those one goal losses, if we can turn around all of them. That would be that would be perfection. Uh, but if we can turn around even half of those one goal losses, it would put us uh, in a great position. Uh, NCAA wise at large and for the uh, MAC playoffs. It, the leadership has been strong since, since we uh, made uh, DR Medtar and Dylan Holly captains, but we also have some other players stepping up this year. Uh, Jay Smith, who was our top goal scorer last year, uh, he's provided some leadership. Uh, Matt Stellatano, the, uh, the sophomore goalkeeper, uh, who had a great season last year as a freshman, he's really stepped up as well. Um, and, and overall, everybody has. All the returning players have, have taken the new players into their wing. Uh, we have uh, Chris Gonzalez, a freshman center back, who's really uh, shown, well, uh, shown well this uh, this past preseason. So we're we're excited. We want everybody to be a leader, and we're hoping everybody will continue to be confident and show leadership. Well, I think this is a fun team, and I, I hope that people will come out and watch the games. This is a very fun team. It's a very quick team. Uh, we play the, the beautiful game of soccer the right way. Uh, we pass and move. We're gonna uh, we're gonna score a lot of goals this year. We're we're gonna hopefully not let, let too many goals in. That's our goal. Uh, we just helped with move in last week, and the guys just even after two a days, they were still having fun. They were they were connecting with other freshmen around uh, around the campus. So this is a fun group of guys. They're gonna be entertaining. Uh, to say the least on the field. So I would definitely uh, recommend everybody trying to come out and watch these guys play.